All right, what have we got here? Roberto's house. In Spanish, guys, they don't really have an apostrophe S. So if you want to say Roberto's house, you have to say La Casa de Roberto, of Roberto. See, there's no S here, there's no apostrophe here. The house de, of Roberto. So, El Libro de Maria, Maria's book. So you're always going to have to have the noun, and then de, and the name of the person. Check this out. So, in English, if you're saying, uh, we're going to the Blanco's house. So imagine Roberto has a mum and a dad and a sister, and their surname is Blanco, without the S. And you're saying, oh, we're just going to go to the Blanco's, we're going to the Blanco's house. Again, no apostrophe S in Spanish. So you would say, vamos a la casa de los Blanco. No S. We go, vamos a la casa, to the house, de, of, los, Blanco. And this los, this is the article in Spanish. It's called an article. You don't need to know that, though. And it's plural here, which indicates that the Blanco is plural. It's relating to the Blancos as a whole, the, the family. And before I show you a couple more quick tricks, please do subscribe to the channel. 71.5%. It's higher than last week. I'm freaking out. It means a lot to me. So just please hit the subscribe button and support me. Gracias. Now, the 90s. The 90s was a great era. In English, we say the 90s. In Spanish, you have something similar. You just say los 90 in this case, or los 80 for the 80s. You can even say los años 90. But notice again, there's no apostrophe S, and they have los. The article here, plural, that relates to the 90, and it shows los, plural, that there's, you know, indicates um, the apostrophe S. Los 90 fueron una gran era, the 90s. And you might notice sometimes over text, and sometimes when uh, speakers are, are talking, Spanish speakers, they'll say pa, like para. So on text, they'll abbreviate the para to P-A and then apostrophe. And pa que, pa que, instead of para que. So it's quite slangy, quite local, native talk. Um, so just that's another one to be to be aware of again using apostrophes in Spanish and if you want to know what loque means super popular phrase I explain it in the video below check that out it won't take long again please do like and share this video subscribe to the canal it means so much to me and leave a comment if you have any questions I'll of course get back to you un abrazo chicos ciao